right around the corner. And if you have children in school, they're about to have a lot more free time. Maybe a little too much. Yes, right? probably. Time for those summer camps. It's a great way for kids to stay occupied while they're out of the classrooms, just hanging out in the summer. So the Kenwood Police Department, they're offering a summer camp a little bit of their own. So joining us now to tell us a little bit more about it, we've got Sergeant Tim. Thanks so much for being here. Of course. How are you today? I'm fantastic. All right, so this camp, we talked a little bit about it, but tell us more about what kids can expect when they go. So this allows us to have kids that may be interested in law enforcement come in and get a really better idea of what being a police officer is or anything in the criminal justice field. Uh, they can ask questions, they can have conversations with police officers and detectives and uh, different units with, within the police department and, and kind of really understand what it might be about. And now this is for older kids. Um, this is for kids who really may be interested in following this as a career path. Tell us who you're looking for and, and what they need to bring to the table. So ideally, if they have an idea that this might be something that they, they are looking towards uh, in the future, we're looking for sophomores, juniors, seniors, and graduating seniors uh, in high school that may want to become a police officer or go into the field. Uh, we're looking for them to apply and then they can come in and during the week we are going to go through different scenarios, we're going to do building searches, we're going to have different speakers come in and talk with them through the detective bureau, uh, our special response team will come in, uh, we'll take them out to uh, usually Grand Rapids Community College, we go out there for a day, we use some building searches out there, they talk to the director uh, if possible so they can get an idea of what college might look like or at least an idea of one of the colleges in the area. Uh, and what they have to do to prepare themselves in the future. Wow, so Tim, this isn't a camp where you know you go and you just play games all day, <laughs> and you run around in the grass and just eat snacks. They're learning real they life are. skills here. Are you seeing that interest uh, so far in that camp? We have, last year we had a very large class. I think we had around 25 wow. uh, from all over. We had them up, uh, actually we had one student was all the way up in Baldwin that came down oh, wow. every day. Uh, it was a Monday through Thursday. He came down every day uh, from 10 to 4 to, to show up and did a great job and was there on time. And, and we structure it. It's, it's very structured uh, that we want them there on time, their uniforms, and that we provide the uniforms. We provide um, lunch each day. Everything is provided outside of wearing you know, black, black pants, black shoes, and, and show up every day on time with a good attitude. That's all we're looking for. Wonderful. So you can really be anywhere as long as you can get yes. to, to Kentwood. It is not restricted to West Michigan. If you're willing to put the time in to get there, we'll put the time into you to, to make sure you have a, a good week. Cool. All right. So if people are watching this, now mm -hmm. they're interested, where can they go to learn more or sign up? So if they go to Kentwood, uh, kentwood.us backslash youth academy, they can go on and sign up. Uh, for the youth youth academy they can do it online or they can mail it in applications are due by this friday oh, so okay. we will be yeah. contacting everybody by next week to let them know when the follow-up meeting will be we, requ we require them to come in um, for one meeting to kind of get uniforms uh, sign some paperwork and make sure that they're committed to the program uh, prior to and then yeah they'll have all the information they need okay is there any cost associated with this at all there is no cost no at cost. all as long as they can get there we are going to provide everything for them okay. uh, the, the duty belts the shirts the cups some Kentwood PD swag and oh, awesome. some lunches during the afternoon there you go. yeah all right sergeant well thanks so much you said this is year two hopefully it year, goes on year two for me hitch. we had a mix with COVID and then we had one before that but so far it's been a great experience oh wonderful yeah, yeah so, so much yeah, thank deadline you. Friday though to get those applications